Happening this weekend, you'll be able to witness a lunar eclipse that you won't be able to see again for a couple years. Eric Zernick shows more on how the on this phenomenon and how you can make sure you don't miss it. Sunday night, the moon is going to be going through Earth's shadow. We call it a total lunar eclipse because the moon will go completely into Earth's shadow. The eclipse will be happening from 9 in the evening until a little after midnight, with the maximum eclipse occurring at 11:12 p.m. And while the moon is slowly getting blocked out by the Earth, you might notice it change colors. The color of the eclipse will vary across the moon itself, depending on uh, how close to the very center of Earth's shadow each part of the moon is. So we may be able, for instance, to see the upper left part of the moon, a slightly different shade of color than the lower right. And that's something you might want to look for. Then, when the moon is completely eclipsed, it will change into another color. Sunlight going through Earth's atmosphere will be bent under the moon to give it a kind of characteristic odd orangish red color. If you would like to experience the eclipse with a crowd, you can head downtown to the Lafayette Science Museum. You can also see it by coming down to Park Sans Souci if it's a clear night. We'll have some telescopes out and we'll show people uh, the eclipse through the telescope. But if you don't want to stand out in the freezing cold temperatures, you can watch the eclipse online. We are also going to try to live stream this on our YouTube channel, the Lafayette Science Museum YouTube channels. Reporting in Lafayette, Eric Zernick, KTC TV3.